Hey guys, this is Delroy Gill with the r, r Group, a part of Remax Structure. Just wanted to do a quick video on doing home improvements and increasing the value of your home. Um, so I'm sure everybody kind of knows just with HGTV and all the shows out there, kitchen and bathrooms um, are the probably the best bang for your buck on return on investment in putting money into your actual property itself. If you have a property and um, it, it needs some work done to it, don't concentrate on the landscaping, concentrate on the kitchen, concentrate on the bathrooms, concentrate on paint, um, flooring, lighting, those types of things inside the property that will make a difference. So just a couple of quick tips. Um, what you do need to watch out for is overspending or underspending. Um, so I'll give you a, an actual example right now um, and if anybody out there is familiar with the Denver Metro market um, I have a property that is uh, located in the Park Hill area right by Denver Zoo very hot and up and coming market houses are selling anywhere from 500 to 1.5 million over there we have a listing it was um, uh, should have been I should say it should be in the realm of a six probably anywhere from five fifty to six hundred thousand dollar property um, homeowner came in I walked through the property they had already done the remodel prior to me getting involved um, with the transaction and the unfortunate thing is the upgrades that they have done in the property are not to the standard or to the styling more importantly for that neighborhood they updated the house they put in you know the neutral tones the browns um, the uh, the dark copper um, finishes on the faucet in the bathrooms and just very monotones um, in the, the the choosings of the tiles and the fabrics that they used in the home which if it was in the suburbs would have totally been okay and have sold this is a neighborhood where it's either houses are being scraped to completely modern homes um, houses are being fixed and flipped left and right in the neighborhood so we've now got a home that's been updated and a ton of money has been spent in it but it's just not styled to the community a lot of the things when you're styling your home check out the magazines check out what's in your area especially if there's new builds in your area the new build is going to be the most general and uh, most safe direction to go in if you're thinking about selling your house um, so drive around the neighborhood see what those new builds are doing and try and kind of you don't have to spend as much as they do but color um, styling palette try and be along those lines if you're not selling your house excuse me and you're just want to do the styling and you want to do a remodel for you and you're going to be living in the house for let's say another five years don't worry about it paint the walls pink green purple multicolored paint a flag on the wall I don't whatever you want to do you're gonna live with it and then after you know make sure there's some room in there to maybe tone it down but you can be a little bit more extravagant but if you're thinking about selling your house you really really need to pay attention to what's happening in the market or you can make a big mistake so contact me my contact information will hopefully be coming up on the screen here um, and it will also probably be down in this in the description box that's what I'm looking for um, and we'll be able to come out and do free evaluations for you thank you for checking us out we're here to serve your real estate needs anytime you need us on our group see you again thanks bye